Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be trying out the viral, TikTok viral, Michaela controversial TikTok viral L'Oreal telescopic mascara. So if you want to see how this performs, like if it is the real deal, it's obviously not the real deal on her lashes. But like, genius to whoever marketed that, that they're like, oh yeah, oh my god, L'Oreal Telescopic, so amazing. And then cuts to her having false lashes on. We're all like, hey, no, that's fake, but I want to try out this mascara. I thought the mascara was on sale for 15 something. It wasn't, it was $20. I would never buy a mascara from the drugstore for $20. Like I was like, oh, why did I do that? But I needed to try it because of like her controversial TikTok. And I wanna see if it does anything and show it to you guys and give you guys an honest review on it without putting fake lashes on. Uh, but kudos to L'Oreal and Michaela for being very savvy with their marketing on this mascara because it just made it good or bad. It made people want to try it. So let's do this. Let's try it out. I got mine in the blackest black and not waterproof because I ain't about that. So yeah, let's try it out. So the claims are to that it's going to lift your lashes to the next level with up to plus five millimeter of longer looking lashes. The exclusive double hook bristle, bristle brush catches and charges every lash to give an instant length lift and volume for up 36 hours. Uh, that is a long time to keep mascara on your eyes. 24 would be a long time to keep mascara on your eyes. So if you are pulling an all nighter and a half, good. This mascara will last for you. So that is amazing. Um, step one, lift and load your lashes using the front hook bristle. Apply from root to tip. Step two, use the side hook comb to separate your lashes for added volume and length. It removes easily with soap and water. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, so that is what it's unique about this mascara is the double-sided wand, I guess. All right, first thing I'm gonna curl my lashes. We're gonna curl our lashes the way Alex Earl tells us to curl our lashes. We're gonna get in there and we're gonna squeeze and lift and we want it to pinch and we want our eyeball to look crazy. So we want it to have a little bit of a pinch. My blur, my eye vision is going a little blurry on that side. So that's when you know you've done it right. Do the other one. Looks a little crazy. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do a side by side with another mascara just to see if like it's it's really legit. And let me make sure I don't use the wrong side of the wand first. Again, I am like, why did I spend twenty dollars on mascara? Like that is such a waste to me. Oh, okay. That looks weird. Cause like what is the front and what is the back? Front. Okay, let's see if this is the front. And I really like to get in those corners and lift all the little bitty lashes out. I like the flutteriness I'm getting. Okay, now I did it wrong. I did it wrong. I was supposed to use the front first, but 
it's fine. Well, it's fine. It's fine. Oh my gosh, I was so worried about doing it wrong and I did it wrong. It's all good. We're going to use the front again. And then the side. Like, I don't think, I don't, it's fine. It actually does <laughs> give you quite the lift. Sorry if you hear my son in the background. I wish I used the front first. I thought, oh, sorry. The way it looks, like the picture that they give you, it looks like you're supposed to use the little bristles first, but it says the word front. Wow, it's pretty good. All right, on my other eye, I'm just gonna go in with the Essence Lash Princess. This mascara is probably like $3, but I love it. Okay, let's see if there's a major difference. I don't I don't see a major difference I don't this is looks a little darker because it's black as black I guess but let me look in the mirror Sorry. I'm trying to find where a $20 mascara is worth more than my essence for three, four dollar mascara. Myth is busted. Myth busters. It looked cool when I just had it on one eye. Yeah. I don't think it's, I'm gonna just go in with the side hook on this side. Just to, like this might help extend them a little bit. Give you a little bit of separation, let's say. But it also kind of just clumps them together a little more. Even on the packaging, like her mascara looks a little bit clumpy. I don't know. I don't think it's worth 20 bucks. All right. So there you have it. It's not worth the hype, but it was a great marketing ploy, plot what have you it got me to buy the mascara because i just needed to see try it out for myself i will use it it's good it's not bad i bought it so i'm gonna use it and yeah it's not worth the hype but if you want to try it out have at her all right thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i will see you guys again soon